introduction of a central bank digital currency will give a boost, a big boost to digital economy. It is therefore proposed to introduce digital rupee using blockchain and other technologies to be issued by the Reserve Bank of India starting 2022 and 23. Finance Minister Nirmala Sitaraman, in her budget speech on Tuesday, announced that the Reserve Bank of India will introduce digital rupee, central bank digital currency, in the next financial year, beginning April 2022, to boost the digital economy. Uh, it, it is very similar to a fiat currency, but of course it has the backing of the Central Bank of India. There, so the idea seems to be that there is an inherent trust uh, and the trust that you have, in, say, in a fiat currency, say, uh, in a 500 rupee note or a 2000 rupee note or a 1020, any note that you have. So that is the idea that the central bank will, of course, again, issue this currency, but it will be in a digital form. So the CBDC, uh, as we discussed, is being uh, will be launched by the Reserve Bank of India. So uh, it is not yet clear in coming months, it will probably be clear on what will the various aspects of CBDC, how it will be governed, whether it will be interoperable with other currencies that are out there in the other digital currencies, especially that are out there in the market, or whether it will be interoperable with other currencies of the world and how they will function and you know they will on what exchange rates they will be uh, you know uh, uh, used across the world. So the budget announcement basically uh, has paved a way for you know the government uh, agreeing that digital currencies are the future and there is a very genuine application of uh, the blockchain technology and you know digital currency not just cryptocurrency the, the uh, avoiding the buzzword not just cryptocurrency but digital currencies as such there is a very very real and practical world application of it so that's the uh, you know, importance of it. Technology experts or, you know, experts across the world, they are saying that there are several models, but a formal announcement, whenever it is done by the Reserve Bank of India, after it is done, it will basically show us that how is this, uh, you know, digital currency going to be interchanged with each other and what will be the value of it, whether you can use it in shopping or whether you can, you can use it, you know, to purchase maybe gold or bonds or whatever. So that part we'll have, we'll still have to wait.